ジャギ様から盗み取った北斗神拳北斗を味合わせてやるわ<笑>First key of the day as well. Let's let's warm up in a in a key we need. Thing is being opened. The floor is absolutely you know, impossible to see what's going on in there. As always, a thousand ground effects. We didn't even pull the Miss Dancer, apparently, so we're taking it slow, which I don't like. That's a pussy-ass move for a non-fortified wick. Or did we pull it out? Actually, no, we didn't. It's there. So that's really bad. That's gonna make us have to, um, you know, lose a lot of stacks. <laughs> we're not even gonna pull back, because we cannot kill any of this in time. But we're not getting... Uh, yeah, we could have actually used the mites. Oh, we're killing this. Okay. Okay, yeah, that's fucked, because we get an infinite mites here, right? Or do we, like, stop getting them as soon as we pull this? Also, yeah, we got the Miss Dancer, they're gonna be doing a lot of shit around us. This is gonna be very fucked. The camera is dog shit in this dungeon, of course it is. Oh, I'm gonna clear some traps. I don't wanna risk it. But we can't really stay here anymore. We got the herb, but the Miss Dancer is still a one shot. I don't see where that thing is anymore. I think I'm still safe here, though. Yeah, I am. There's no projectile coming my way, yeah. Okay, we're just about to kill him. Okay, that's good. The tank team did pretty good, actually. So that's not a bad pull, actually, but it's a bit slower than if you just skip that. Like, killing that brute is not time efficient. You could just kill it with this pack as well if you if you pull everything on the first one with the Miss Dancer. And now we lost a stack, so this pack and the next one are going to be extremely slow. Uh, but yeah, better take it safe than to wipe, honestly. That is until we get to the end boss and we don't have time. <laughs> and then I cry because I use the heal and legendary and I do no damage. It's not like Vanguard's momentum is that big of a deal. Like it's it is damage, but it's not gonna mean you know two K overall. It's just gonna mean like maybe half a K. Not even. So it's not the end of the world. Why am I auto targeting the fucking Whoa? Yeah, we're keeping getting Earths, everything's looking juicy, everything's looking good. No weird buys, no weird woes, we just want to get more damage going. Okay. Approaching the boss. We got wings forever now, apparently. It's been up for ages. Tang looks uh, slightly not too solid, but this pack has been going on for a little while now, a minute and a half almost. He's still standing strong. Admittedly, it's not fortified, but you know he's like uh, what is it, thirty-six fifty, thirty-six thirty. Decent score for a blood decay, but there's a lot of one trick ponies and flavor of the month rather. So that score is not the greatest for a flavor of the month reroll. Here we go to the boss now, finally. We got the beacon on the mage. It's gonna be 
unable to be healed for the longest time. There we go, we got a prog, we got the error, we dropped some shit. I don't really, I mean, I could save the two set here. Why are you doing that? I'm not, why are you doing that? Okay, that's that's dumb as fuck, but that's gonna make it so that the rest of the people do it, and that's not exactly what I wanted. I had a two set, like, I can heal that immediately. Like, that doesn't even do any damage. Okay, well, whatever. Get close to melee. Hopefully, no. We almost died immediately because we soaked too many orbs. But please, mate, soak yours. Okay, he did. Good. Okay. There we go. I, I'll take this to the face so they can see that we're fine. It's two set procs, so it doesn't do any damage. Easy. Now they know. Next one is going to be Devo. We have a charge of hammer ready. We throw it now. By the time it hits, we get the leech effect going on. And people are already in melee, so we can bump some healing. There's a lot of orbs in the back, though. I need to get some of that shit. I cannot be here waiting for them to get close while my wings are getting wasted. That's how this class works. You need to use your wings when they are up. I'm taking this one safe because I didn't have time to heal anything. They didn't help me out with the soaks, but yeah. If I was in comms, I would be calling the mates to soak those as soon as possible, but otherwise I gotta get out of melee to do that, and it's it's actually horrible. I don't know. Uh, I hate when that happens. I should have just used uh, flesh cuts a little bit earlier because I forgot I don't have the right soul bind for it. Once again, they're not soaking anything, so... Gonna have to do it badly. This is gonna cost us. Oh, they they, they soak them then at the end. Well, we can we can take that to the face. Fortunately, not too bad, but have to burn the on hands there. Oh my god, a tangle down to ten percent. Not even. No personal just yet. We get it there, we're pretty dry now. We do get some Bankrisher hammer rolling. I'm afraid for the tank, honestly. That's really all I'm afraid at this point for. A lot of orbs coming close. That's not what you like to see. I can't bob myself though. But yeah, if they soak them before they're that close, man, like they 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 that would not be an issue, but yeah. Everything lines up. I need time before the orbs get to me. And uh, before the charge happens, so I can top people up there. It's close, so... Oh, 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 okay, hold well, it's it's dead. It is one minute slower than the previous one we did up, actually. Last one was... We were at 6 minutes 42 when we killed the boss. That was also a decently quick boss, though. 30 minutes, 14 seconds. So we just did a very slow first part of the dungeon. Yeah, look at that. He was aiming his back at the mobs, meaning he probably got hit in the back a couple times. So he was so low. I don't really want to dispel a tank on this. Not like he gives a fuck. We'd rather dispel those. Ooh, so going through. The two stacker, we want to get rid of that one. All right, here we are. About to go into the first urn. We're still in the game. We haven't died. Nobody's died anyways still. So we're we're Gucci. Maybe not the quickest run in the beginning. Well, here we are. Positive. I love how Russians reply to things instead of with a yes or a no, with a plus or a minus. Other people do as well, but a lot of Russians do it. Most Russians do and it just uh, looks cool.
Uh, I'm bopping the tank, honestly. I might be getting silenced here, though. We do have a cur uh, decurs, though. Yeah, that's fine. We, we do have a decurs. So we're getting full stacks here. Hopefully we can extend now. We wait until the bursting is gone. And now we go. We have shrouds, so we don't even have to burn the potions. Six, five. Oh, that's going to be tight. Three. No, it's fine. Ooh, yeah. Okay. Off we go to the urn. That was a quick skip. Much quicker than last time. Hopefully we can open the urn here immediately. Please no invisible vellums, man. I swear to God. Oh my God, a tank. That's the biggest worry I have. Oh, the Robogon almost ripped aggro somehow. Open the urn, man. Just open it. Okay, it's open. Let's go. So we got the extender going. We just got to not die. Shouldn't like this part of the dungeon is giga easy, but you never know, man. We also pulled the gargoyle here, which is uh, pretty ballsy. But that's also um, very good for us if we don't die, honestly. Oh boy, look at that! He's going down so low. Okay, I don't give a fuck about the burst thing. That's not my business. We're going for the next extendo. We didn't do that. Uh, this might be an angle where we go backwards and get... Okay, maybe not. Maybe just, we're just not playing that back at all. Which, I don't know if it's a good idea. We're passing in on a relic and an easy mob to kill. For a lot of percent. This is messy though. This is very messy. But we will probably go earn now. Okay, he's opening. That's good, that's good. He's opening now. Deeker's going through. We have a Deeker's. Perfect. No problem with that. Quill Feather casting. We got a, okay, another one. That's probably on cooldown now. So that's a, that's a sack angle. Okay, it's it's it, the cooldown is pretty short actually. So I just wasted my sack. I thought it was going to be a little bit longer. Oh, uh, that's another Deeker's. No Ice Block, but it's back up. So he can dispel that one. Good, good, good. We got the Extend though. This is perfect. A lot of stacks going through here. Seven stacks and eight stacks is pretty scary, but we managed to do it. Some off heals going through, I believe. No, absolutely no. Actually, zero off heals. Not even helping out. This is the second Sentinel, so we don't have to kill one after the first one. Oh, this second boss. Uh, this is a massive pull, though. But we do have ten stacks, so we gotta do it. Like now is the time to do it. That's a decor going through. Tank flying up. He doesn't have Dancing Room weapon, I believe. No, he doesn't. He just has... Bamp. A lot of damage happening. Things are dying relatively quickly, though. Another set of massive stacks. Morning it for Astaroa. I'm saying goodbye. Okay, I think this is... Oh my god, we just pulled. Alright, well, no mana. We still have some stacks, though, so it's gonna be decent. Actually, they're gone now, so... Giga Hopium. Now it's uh, basically make or break it. We gotta kill the uh, Manifestation as soon as we can. Gotta be relatively greedy with my stuff here. Took a little bit too long. But I gotta save up stuff. I can't get caught lacking later on. Although we have the year though, so that's gonna be, you know, gonna be able to get uh, some CDR rolling. Deja la suelo. Ay mismo. We gotta kill this dude now. Oh, that's bad. He's got a melee. But that one was free. We have the year. We're moving a bit too much though, but okay, that's fine. 67%, we have the worst to go through still. We don't see the R on Winx now. We're gonna be extending this. That's a block. Still in my bubble. Adds the lust. It goes down. Manifestation, this one's gonna flop. 
I'm gonna have to use some of my charges of Banquish or Summer so we can just not waste them, honestly. 50%! Uh, that's a rough spot, but he's doing it. That's fine. We have everything for the next one. Manifestation should be fine on this one. We have literally everything. I'm just really scared to not die here, so that's all I care about. Banquish or Hammer down. Where's the circle coming? It should be coming now. Yeah, there it is. That's a pretty rough spot. The guy moved backwards. You don't want to have too many melee on this boss. It's always bad because of that. Residue coming. The boss is down to 30%. Castigate coming soon. Gotta apply a Fleshcraft. We got the ball coming around very soon. We're still in the wrong spot, I believe, for that one. Yeah, that's the wrong spot. He's gonna get a debuff, but he can always dispel himself. Okay, there it is. Manifestation. This is gonna be a rough one. Gonna Diva this. Hopefully the Castigate is on me. Okay, that was pretty quick as well, actually. So if I take Castigate here, I should be fine. Yep. I'm fine with that one. Should have saved the AMC. I, have, I still have Bubble. I'm just scared of the Castigates together with the Manifestation. That's really the big problem here. This might be a rough one, but we have we have a hammer. We have combust. Ah, that's actually easy. We bubble this so we don't take any damage. Top everybody with two set, and that's the kill. Easiest boss of my life. I, you don't even need to do any healing. Like, look at that. 12k is actually very low healing. You just gotta play it properly and avoid taking extra damage. And that's a very easy boss kill. 60 minutes on the board. Really, really good. Looking fine as fuck. Still nervous though. Uh, we still gotta get to the third boss. And the gauntlet. A lot of ways of wiping in this dungeon. Even if it's not fortified, everything just hurts so much. Uh, yeah, we're going to kill some more stuff over here. For sure. We did skip the, the guy. With the relics over there, so... I still think that that was a bad choice, but at least we got a little bit of the buff onto the boss, honestly. Maybe it just expired, like, literally as soon as we pulled the boss, but... That Bellum is disgusting. But... Yeah, here we go. Killing some trash. We don't even need to kill another Gargoyle. We already dealt with both the ones that are on this floor, so... Going for a little bit of Shield of the Righteous here. There's so many mobs stacked up. I don't even know if it's the right call, but that's the way Paladin goes. You just gotta feel it. A lot of stacks. Extend though? No, they knew better than to extend. Another dungeon port? Nice. Okay, I think we just got this pack to go through, actually. We got some relics here, so... Oh, that's rough. A lot of throw... Uh, not flashes, throw researchers on this one. Oh, he's still in the vellum. Is there a res? I got a res. Oh, the, the, the tank actually threw it out, which is rough. And I don't think that's a good choice here. We gotta kill the ur. But it comes down to here. A lot of Bellums, a lot of error denial. The amount of shit on the ground and the amount of damage going out here is quite nasty. Doing more healing here than on the boss, honestly. Still have a buff to go through here if something looks dire. But we got the air rolling, so we should be fine. Ooh, that is one death on the board. We still have two battle races, another one coming up soon, so that's gonna be the second one. And here comes the stacks. Ooh, I throw research. Okay, we got all the percent we needed from here, I believe so. And we're going down to the third boss. Timer looking omega fine, like you can't even believe in how good that looks. Oh, a little bit of trash clearing before we set up to this shit. How long is the CD on block? Can they get like a second block during this fight? They can, right? 
So if they block first, will they be able to get a second one? I don't think I get a second bubble, honestly. It's uh, three and a half minutes. If I do, it's like very late on, so probably not a uh, not happening. Okay, there's a the call out. Clock first. We'd rather see some incentives here, or rather some initiative, rather than um, forcing people to do it as you demand. I don't really care who uses what, I just want them to not die. Alright, we hope that they know what side they want to be on. We have Shadowbreaker, so we can do this. Like stand in one corner and then get a lot of uh, orbs in that corner. This is looking bad though. Yeah, this is a uh, rough. Okay, didn't do as much damage as I expected it to. I only had three orbs and I barely took any damage, but that was fleshcraft as well. So why is that three swirlies in the same spot? Holy shit, man! Okay, now it should be, uh, we should be getting a block coming up on this one. I'm getting the dot on me. We have horse, so I can take one, two, three, and uh, four. I don't think I need the fourth one, though. No, I don't. That was with personal, though. I don't think I got the personal for the next one, yeah? Yeah, I don't. So I'll need the fourth one later. The swirlies are stacking on melee so hard. Um, I'll bubble this one so they can pick more. I don't pick anything. I bubble late, so maybe it lasts a little bit longer. Over through the ticking damage. Thick. That's two set. Everybody's completely topped up. And that's good. Now we have no immunities, so. Oh, we have a cloak. Yeah, cloak is back up. Okay. We have personal again as well. And uh, we have a uh, fleshcraft. So we can only take. We, we can take three and even two, and it will be fine. But I'll take another one just to be safe. Doesn't seem like... Yeah, we don't need extra. Tank, Prox, Purgatory. A bit of a monk S scenario. Taking damage after is not a problem. You can light it on people from China, reach everybody, no problem whatsoever. Now we have no immunity, so now it's a Devo angle. Yeah, it's gonna be a Devo angle. I need my two, I need a third one on melee. That's the Devo, that's the personal, that's perfect. Nobody dies. Easy as shit. Taking damage, not a problem. We can go through another charge of Bank Research Hammer. We could even take a nap so during that taking damage, we wouldn't die. Um, once again, we have no immunities here, though. Oh, we have another block. Okay, so my shit is not tracking the second block. So I take one. Oh, I didn't take that one, actually. Three. Should be getting chunked here. Yeah, almost died. We have no personal. But three without personal is still alive in 26. Without, without personal, I would die in 27. For sure. Okay, timer looking absolutely juicy right now. This is looking so good, guys. If we wipe somewhere, we could still do it perfectly fine. So.
it does more damage in Tyrannical, because it's it's the boss. Uh, I'm actually not sure. Once again, there it is. And another jump. This one we're getting. Okay, that was the last pack. Now we got one more to go through. And we got... Um, we got so much time, man. We're not even 30 minutes into the keywords. We're already here, you know what I mean? Like, this is pumping city right now. I'm not even using Banger's momentum either. I didn't get any, a single second of CDR on two sets of Light of Dawn. What? I might have not hit, like, even two people, actually. Some traps. The tank soaked them. And uh, there we go, we go to the boss. Good shit, boss time. This is gonna be a long fight. We have some pumpers in here, so you know. Could be uh, not that long after all. Wait, I avoided it somehow? Okay, that, that did like so much damage to the rogue though. I took that one on Forge. The first one I don't even know if I can escape actually. Okay, we got Urba. Make sure I'm not too close. Like the last time I did this. I know to extend the. Uh... Oh, I got the buck. I got it. I was too close to the target. That's a block, though, so we got rid of that one stack. Makes up for the one that I got. Got a horse again. So I couldn't able. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. We don't. We didn't even get a second stack. Could have been at zero stacks if I didn't take one. Uh, why not? Evil this. And uh, we got the rush coming. I can move in here. I don't think I can avoid this though. Maybe. Oh yeah. If I could just keep running completely away from her. Then I can. But if I wasn't the first one to get charged. Maybe I couldn't have guessed the angle. And then. Would have been a different story. We got one stack. Oh, that was a delayed rush back. I could have gotten a stack there as well. She's halfway through. It's gonna be a charge on us. So we move out. And nobody. Oh, the rogue got it because he got too close. He was not even targeted by it. Okay, one stack is completely fine though. Another charge on me. I don't know if I can dodge this one. I don't have any space. I did though. Okay. Somehow dodge there. We're gonna bob that one just to be completely safe. Mage got in last second. Okay, about 30% to go through. It's one stack only. Oh, I almost got one. I should get us something to tell me who it's targeted. Okay, I, mean, I can just look at the nameplates when the, the thing goes through. Okay, I got that one. It's a bit too slow to move out there. I moved towards it as well. It is completely fine. It's on me. No horse, we just move away from it. And we still got it. Oh my god, we got three. Okay, this is a that's a bubble. They were too close to melee, and sometimes when she rushes back, she does damage. 
Oh, he got a second stack. That's when we wanted the buff. We can stack though. Uh, it's gonna be uh, an easy one though. It's fine in the end. I didn't hit the rock with my ladder down. And I, I don't know how he died. He just didn't get in it. Okay. Well, the boss is dead. We timed the key with six minutes to go. Well, okay, that's gonna be three points. Five points! Let's go. Okay, I'm so safe now. I am so safe. Jeez. Okay. Five points for that one. I didn't even... I had. I already had a 26. So it was just the fact that it's such good time. Woo! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. So that, that is definitely a safe zone at this point. It's, it's gone up like 0.4 or more.